Hamisvah Kof Lamed, the hundred and thirtieth Misvah. Hasivuish Nistavenu Lehafrish Maased Ani Bechol Shana Shereshit Minashimita. This is the Misvah called Maased Ani. We spoke about Maased Rishon, which is given to Levim. Maased Mina Maased, given from the Levim to the Kohanim. Maased Sheni, which is eaten by the owners in Yerushalayim. And now Maased Ani, which is every third year. So in the third and sixth year of the Shemitah, Begama Shelishit Ahare Shelishit. So meaning the third year and the third year after the third year, which is the sixth year, Kilomar, Beshishit Mina Shemitah. Vomro Yit Ale, Mikse Shalosh Shanim, Tosye Koma Asar Tebuatecha, Bashanahi, Binahta Bisharecha, Tibarim Perikyo Dalet, and Perashat Re. Again, this is the Hova. To give ma'asir to the aniyim every third year, known as ma'asir ani. Begamzo ena hoba mina Torah illa be Eretz Israel. This is not obligated except for in Eretz Israel from the Torah. Uchbar nit ba arnu de misvazo maseret pea maseret dema maseret maasro. Bechama inyani mimena mefuzarim komot mispar mishar masertot zeraim maseret machshirim beadayim. But again, this mitzvah speaking about giving a ma'aset to the aniyim, a crucial misvah when it comes to thinking about others who are less fortunate, the ger, the yatom, the almana, those who are less fortunate than us, who are unable to have the means. And around the holiday time, uh, we must be thinking about those who are less fortunate, who are in need of our help and our assistance. And if able to, we should be able to provide and help them to be able to celebrate this time of year, the time of the hagim, with happiness by us being able to be misameach the aniyim, and with that we emulate Hakadosh Baruch Hu, who's misameach the lev ha aniyim, the hearts of the aniyim, by allowing them to rejoice just like we're rejoicing. Hamisvah Kof Lamed Aleph, the hundred and thirty-first misvah. Hasivu shenis tavenu litvadot lefanavit ale. The misvah to do vidui, to confess. What? That we separated our obligation of giving ma'asrot and terumot. Just like we actually physically separate the terumot and ma'asrot, we have an obligation through speech to announce and to be mitvadeh to confess and announce that we indeed separated the Tirumot Ma'asrot. V'zehu ha'nikra vidui ma'asir. V'asivui bazehu omro yit'ale. V'amarta lifne Adonai Elohecha. V'yarti ha'kodesh min ha'bayit. V'cham netativ la'levi ve'la'gelaton ve'la'almana. And I did everything according to the way that it's prescribed. Again, this misva of vidui ma'asir is found in Perashat Kitavo in Sevet Evarim, Perek Kavav, Pasuk Yod Gimal. Uchban nitpa'anu dine misva zo, ve'ofen ha'bi'or, bi'or here, not meaning burning, but separating. Ve'inyano pe'ferek aharon ma'asir sheni. It's important to note the halakha of when is this vidui done, so the Rabbam says in Mishneh Torah, wherein ilchot ma'asir sheni, when does one do this vidui? In the fourth and seventh year, so it's following the third and sixth year. Which is ki Which is hak Again, this is done by Yom. And it's done. And this is called the Misvat Ase of Vidui Maaser. Baruch Amen.